Okay, so I've destroyed all that infrastructure that we just created. And what I want to do now is actually test that with 0.12. Um, hopefully it just works. And after we do that, then we'll play around some more if it works. Um, we've released actually some alphas that you could just download uh, directly from here. Um, I am not going to use this. I'm going to build from source because uh, I need to use providers that we're not providing with the alpha. So the alpha only has all the major cloud providers, uh, template, the null provider, and a few others. Uh, I need Cloudflare. That's the big one that I need. So what I'm going to do is actually just build from source. Um, although if you have if you're just using some major providers, you could give this a shot. So I've already cloned out Terraform here. Um, I'm on the 0.11 branch, so let's go to master. I think I'm all up to date here, which I am. Uh, and then let's go ahead and build it. So this is using Go modules. So let's go ahead and turn that on and then build it. You do that with make dev. This will take, uh, on a reasonably powered machine, it'll take maybe about 30 seconds the first time you do it. Okay, so it's all done. If we were on Terraform version, we could see that uh, it's Terraform 0.12 now. And I always like to sanity check uh, when this was modified. So it looks like it was today, and that's roughly now. So just in case, I've, I've had some issues in the past where like it wasn't being installed in the right place or anything. So. That's that. If we go back to our Terraform directory, we could run Terraform plan, and we should get errors, which we did because we haven't updated the providers yet. So next, what I have to do is update the providers. And just again, when, when 0 0.12 actually comes out, like this will all have been done for you. I'm just doing this because we're building from source. We're basically having the developer experience right now. Um, so I need to build this provider. I think this has a make dev, maybe not. Um, I think it's just a go build actually. Uh, this is gonna not work because I just wanna make sure builds in general right now. Um, but what we actually have to do to update this is we need to update the provider's um, Terraform vendor, the framework that it uses, the provider framework that it uses uh, to the dot 12 SDK. So I'm just sanity checking that it builds in general to start. And this is my first time building this on this machine. so. It's building all the dependencies too. That's why it's taking so long this time. Okay, so it builds. Uh, that's good. It runs. Uh, so what we need to do now is actually use this with dot twelve. The easiest way to do that is to use Go modules. So if I turn Go modules on and then do a Go mod in it then this will set up the modules from our vendor file. Okay, and then if I go, we have a go mod now, you can see, and if I go build again, it should use that go mod, and I'm gonna do this again, just to sanity check that it works. Yep, so it's downloading all these dependencies now. Okay, and it built, so this is really good. That means that the go module stuff works. Um, let's verify it again, it looks good. So let's remove that. And what we now need to do is actually update our, uh, our Go mod that points to Terraform. Uh, gonna grab it. Uh, we have to update this one in particular um, to point to master, uh, to, to point to our current checkout. So let's get the current commit. So we have that. And I think I could just do this. So let me just commit actually so that I could see changes. Like we don't need a good message. I'm gonna throw all this away anyway. Um, and if I do this, I think that'll do the right thing. Okay, so a lot of stuff happened. Um, it mostly worked, so it was able to get this. I think I got a bunch of new dependencies that were updated. I don't know. If I look at the diff, uh, I see a lot of stuff updated. Um, but most importantly, Terraform is updated to that. Um, we did get an error, though, which I just blasted away. So I don't think this is going to work. 
Maybe it did. Maybe it did work. Let me just, for sanity, I'm going to build it again. Yeah, okay. That looks like it worked. So this provider should now actually be the most up-to-date provider. Okay, so to install this, uh, we have to put it in the Terraform plugins directory, which doesn't exist right now. So I'll make that. And I think what I could do is just move it in here. Uh, I think it has to have a version too. So let's make it version like some crazy so we know that we're actually going to use it like 9.9.9. .9 cool. So let's make sure that works by going over here, running a Terraform in it. And we can see that we got 9.9. .9 for AWS and Cloudflare still outdated. So if we run an apply now, we should only get one error and Cloudflare is now outdated. So this is how you compile a new plugin to work with uh, to work with the latest .12 SDK. And so let's move ahead and do Cloudflare next.